currently setting the laptop up. We're going to be testing four games. And I'm not sure if I am live just yet. Gave me a little error. I don't see the time. I think we are live. That's interesting that it did do that. Yep, we are live. Okay, so we're going to test four games on the Asus G16 2023 model. And we're going to play in different modes, different settings. And let's see. Can we already add a thumbnail to the stream? Yes, we can. So while I'm talking, I'm also setting the stream up. Use this as a title. Use this as the description. Recording date. I'm going to make the stream public. Whoops. Accidentally added the wrong thumbnail. Or did I? This is the right thumbnail. All right. And I'm going to go to the live stream here. There we go. All righty then. So we're going to start off with GTA. Somebody asked me for GTA 5. And I uphold my end of that promise. What's up, Phantom? How you doing, brother? Thanks for stopping by, man. So we're gonna start off with GTA 5. Let's start up the benchmark. And we're going to just play between different modes. See, yes, we can switch that with a single click. That's awesome. Are you still at your dad's place? Yes, and very soon I will have my own house again. And there's going to be a lot of streams coming from there. This means it is charging. I think this is the Wi-Fi. I think this is if it's either powered on or off. Just an educated guess. Okay, so let's switch keyboards. I'm going to go for my wireless keyboard here. How do you guys like my Andrew Tate? <laughs> my Andrew Tate character. All right, let's set the settings right because of course it's always locked to Yes, VSync, we turn VSync off. Not half, just off. And advanced display. Wait, graphic settings. God damn it. Everything is on very high. Reset this. Let's see what mode we are playing. So now we're on turbo. We're going to start off with silent mode. Oh. 
We're gonna play as Tub G today. <laughs> oh, before we get banned, let's turn the music off because they've put copyright music in this game. It would not be the first first time <laughs> I got a, a a demonetization for this for a video. Because of GTA. Ooh. Yo. Yo, he just hit top G. Don't hit top G. So this is a silent mode. Actually, that's a, it is really quiet. Let's see. Let's see what happens if we put it on performance mode. So it's on performance mode now. Just switch a bit around with the settings. Do you recommend this laptop at $1,700? No, I would say that it's too expensive. If you can get this around for like $1,400, $1,500, I think that would be a much better price. I think $1,700 is way too much. Hey bro, how is the quality control for the 2023 RG lineup? Last year they had really bad quality control. Those patches. That is true. The quality control for the first few were very poor. I myself had a very poorly quality checked laptop. Performance was really bad. Thermals were really bad. But this year, at least this model that I have is really freaking good. Let's put it on turbo mode. So it's on turbo now. Not really much changes. This game just runs so easily. I mean, this game is already getting pretty old. Oh, it just blew himself up. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get that guy. Where is he? We need to snipe him. What's your Instagram? I don't have Instagram. Oh, God damn it. That thing was empty. <laughs> I had an empty rocket, uh, rocket launcher. But this one isn't empty. I don't have Twitter either. Why is your GPU use slow? Because the game just doesn't use more. What the hell is that? So let's try a different game. Facebook, that's private. I'm just that YouTube guy. So let's do a different game. I do that for a reason that I don't do all these platforms. I just like YouTube. And um, the reason for that is it's just from <laughs> mental, uh, well, mental cleanliness. If I have to maintain Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, all of that stuff, I would go crazy. So I just do YouTube. 
that makes it easy to find me because I'll be on YouTube. Ben Latai, what's up? So let's do some raising. In my country, it is 2000 with taxes. I hate that. It's the same here, Lacia. It's the same here. If you can get this machine for around fourteen to fifteen hundred dollars or euros, that is a really good price. And there was a link in the description. The price uh, on this one is actually thirteen ninety nine dollars. So that's really freaking cheap. Revolutions. Uh, Jared has actually made a video about that because a lot of people were asking about it, and so did I. And he said the because I'm not that technical as he is. He said that the voltage limit limit um, made the wattage not go up to uh, the maximum, which is fine because he was talking about that above like that 105 watts, you get diminishing returns, and it might not actually be worth it. And I can actually show you that because if we would switch modes, you actually switch the GPU power modes and the FPS basically does not change. Let me just show you. Yeah, 2K euros is way too expensive. Way, way. You, you might as well just buy a 3070 Ti or something like that. Or uh, buy a 3080. It's just not worth it. It's, this laptop is not worth... You can get a 4070 for 2K. That might be closer to worth it. Still, I think that is expensive. Okay, so let me show you the power modes and how or, yeah, how such a small impact the wattage actually has. So we're going to stand still here. Look at a standing still screen. And it's around, well, you name it, the wattage. And we're going to set it to performance mode. Wait, let's start off with silent mode. So we're on silent mode now. And it's going to drop the GPU wattage just a little bit. And now we're going to crank it up by setting it to performance mode. If I'm not mistaken, the GPU wattage should go up a little bit. There we go. We're in the good 80s now. It jumps a little around. But look at the FPS gain. And now we're going to set it to turbo. The effects are just very minimal. You see that? So look at the FPS and I'm going to put it to silent mode now. Silent, I said. So how much FPS did we actually drop? Like, like 10? Not even. But I'm fine with lower wattage GPUs that perform good because that means the temperatures are good. And that means the laptops are quiet. Let me turn up the sound. Actually, the speakers on this laptop are, are okay. They're not bad. I think the last year model or a lot of laptop models from last year had pretty muddy speakers. I actually liked listening to music on this one. 1% 1 low, a bit bad though. Yeah, I think that is also due to the uh, EU model has one single stick of 16 gigabytes. So that's dual channel. But the US models have apparently what somebody put in the comments that he opened the laptop and the US model had um, two sticks of eight, which is quad channel, which is better for the lows. But this game always performs pretty poorly um, when it comes to the lows, if you turn ray tracing on. Boom. I have to say, this, the screen does look really good. 
I thought last year's model screen was a little dim. Why are we not going up the hill? Yeah, the lows are a little bit better when you have quad or dual channel. That is the difference. But for, for the rest, it's, it's very minimum, minimal. My phone battery is draining like crazy. I actually have to get a charger in a second. Okay, let's see if we can make the bridge jump. This or Acer Predator Helios? Which one do you recommend? I would go for a 40, 40, 60 if the price is good, of course. Well, the downside on this laptop as well is that it, my model only has 512 gigabytes of storage. Why, Asus? Why? Can we make the bridge jump? I think we're going to make it. We are going to make it. No! We totally failed. I love this way the this game looks. Okay, let's do a little racing here. Let's just for the fun of it. And then we're gonna play some Battlefield 2042. I think the laptop does have the option to go up to 140 watts. If you maybe, somebody told me like in a comment that he tried a synthetic benchmark and he put it on manual and it actually reached 142 watts, I think, something like that, on the peak. Um, so it, 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 I mean, it is able to reach those numbers, but I don't think it really needs the wattage in order to perform good. Hi, I have AC left of GPU which uh, full fan speed. That's 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 okay. Don't worry. You, guys, what what number of a temperature or CPU temperature makes you worry? Tell me, at what point do you start worrying? Put a number in the chat. What is a number when you start worrying about? And then I'll tell you my number. What number in Celsius makes you worry? I I agree with um Eight eight s I think it's pronounced. Ninety five plus is where I start worrying about CPU temperature. Plus, if it's below that, you're good. Don't worry about it. I think in most cases the thermal th throttling starts to occur at ninety five degrees Celsius plus. The fan noise in this laptop is uh, really, really good. It's probably possible to undervolt it, though I have not tried that. How much improvement Intel G Gen 13? Uh, I think you'll be just as fine with a 12th Gen. I don't think the jump is that big. It's a healthy generational leap, let's put it like that. But if you, if you can get a 12 gen for a much better price, definitely go for that. Does it, are you saying Phantom, it starts at... Are you sure about that? What GPU temperature do you worry about? What number GPU is like your max before you start worrying?
I thought from most benchmarks I've seen, also th synthetic benchmarks, I think it's 95. Let's look into that. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure which of us is right. I think, I, th I think it's 95 degrees. Okay. So Forza Horizon 5 runs like a charm. So we're either going to play Fortnite or Battlefield 2042. Which one? Battlefield 2042 or Fortnite? What do you want to see? Fortnite has a ray tracing as well. Okay, that's a lot of Battlefield 2042. <laughs> So much for the review. I'm definitely getting this soon. Nice, awesome, dude. And if you want to help the channel out and it is available for the good price, please consider using one of my links. You don't pay anything more. And you do support the channel doing that. So yeah, we're going to play Fortnite after Battlefield. I only have four games installed due to shortage on the storage. Any coil wine? None whatsoever. I'll piss off. There we go. So let's start off with low settings, native. There we go. And we're going to start off in silent mode. Ooh, spare head. Hey, also, can we connect external? Yeah, we could do that another day, not today. Once I have my setup again, I can like do all of these things. I can also, instead of recording it like this, I can just record the screen. That's way nicer. The Russians have decided to hit us where we live. I guess they're tired of being paid in the arms race. Our top weapons are provided by a manufacturer named... So, native, 1200p... No DLSS, low settings on silent mode. I'd like to get out of the plane, thank you very much. Are you using a cooler? It is standing on a cooler, but it's not active. Is the field of view messed up or something? Oh my goodness. How are we playing like that? That is so much better. Look at that. It's only using 55. It's on silent mode now, by the way. But look at the performance. This is silent mode. There is very minimal stutters. So if you if you like want to play like really really quietly, like with a laptop that makes no noise, this is your mode. We could tune it up, watch what happens. So we're on performance mode now. 
wattage has increased, but FPS hasn't increased that much. I had to do that, sorry. And let's see what happens if we would put it on turbo mode. So wattage goes up again a little bit, but FPS gain is very minimal. Once again, silent mode. Silent, I said. So it's gonna drop the wattage. Look at the frames. No, it's staying up there. That's weird. Yeah, guys, if you want to help me out, just like the stream. No need for donations. No need for anything. Just I, I would just like a like. it back on turbo mode performance turbo <laughs> I got bump sniped so this is turbo mode you can hear the fans kicking in now I, honestly, I like silent mode. The laptop is, is pretty much quiet. Oh, shizzle. No! The fan noise. Wait, let, let's shut down the sound and let's just listen, okay? Is that annoying? Let's turn up the modes. So let's put it on performance turbo mode. You can hear the fans spinning up a little bit now. No, it's really quiet. It's not annoying at all. Oh, God. So this is pretty much the loudest it gets. <laughs> and if we would turn the sound on, like, let's say 20, uh, let's put it on 30. 40%. You can't, I can't hear the fans now anymore, or at least barely. And we're still playing native, so we could lower the voltage even more by enabling DLSS. So let's put it on auto. This would probably make the system use so silent DLSS auto. There's no frame generation in Battlefield 2042, sadly. If it was, I would most likely not enable it, as uh, frame generation does increase the input lag a little bit. So, it, I mean, the laptop is completely quiet now. Holy cow, guys, so many people watching. Can we get 50 likes? Thanks, guys. Charlie 
I don't think Lenovo has the 4000 series laptops out just yet. To my better knowledge. God damn it, this guy behind me. So this is silent mode. Let's put it on like the turbo mode. Is RTX 3060 far better than this Asus laptop since many of the other? Wait, are we comparing brands or GPUs? This laptop is actually doing really good. Why didn't you just run on MSI? Saberman. <laughs> There's a lot of things I want to do. I just have very limited time. Okay, let's put it on Ultra without DLSS. So, goodbye DLSS. Let's see if we would put it on silent and then ultra settings. It's probably going to fry it, right? What's up, guys? Welcome to the stream. So good to see so many people here. Wow. By the way, if you're looking to buy this laptop, purchase links are in the description for all the different models. And good story. It's probably the best price and it doesn't cost you anything more if you use the links. But you do support the channel and that would be awesome. One hundred and one people watching. Asus, are you taking a look at this? Send me laptops, please. <laughs> uh, no, Bieber, they redirect to your nearest. Uh, uh, it's 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 Amazon links, and they redirect to the most nearby Amazon store in your country. For most countries, that is. Oh, it actually hit 100 watts. <laughs> Itachi, I promised you, man, and I was gonna do it. I actually was considering making a video, but I could do a live stream as well. So it's in the beginning of the live stream. If you want to take a look at it. I'm also thinking about making a video about it. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna play performance mode now. There's just so minimal difference between these modes. God damn it. Yeah, I, guys, if you ask me in comments, like for certain games or for certain settings, and I read it 
And I say, yes, I will do it. I always try to listen to you guys. You, <laughs> you guys are really important to me. So if you have questions and just ask them. Let's put that on auto. Okay, we just gained a good 10 frames. And it feels smoother. Jesus, Louises. Is the MSI GE 67HX already gone? No, it's actually next to me. It's uh, I use that as monitoring a mon monitoring laptop right now. Um, and there's much more coming from that laptop. Uh, but I'm not going to sell that now. I'm going to keep that laptop for a very long time. Because that OLED screen is just... Oh my goodness. It is so good. Turbo... If I turn turbo on, the fans just kick in like straight away. I don't particularly like turbo mode. Even though the fans are not really loud, it's still loud enough for me to hear it when you use the silent mode. I should actually get a sniper. We're almost on 50 likes, guys. Awesome. Can we hit the 50 likes? Let's get MK. Okay. Can you run, you mean this game in lower competitive settings? Sure. Somebody's shooting me, god damn it. So these are low settings. Oh wait, we're actually playing with ray tracing on? Are you kidding me? We were playing with ray tracing on. What? What? The, where did I mess up? Look at the frames now. Oh my God, that's such a big difference. We were playing with ray tracing on all that time. <laughs> I need to plug in my phone, else it'll die. There we go. Wait, what happens if we put it on silent mode now? So this is silent mode, low settings, and DLSS quality. Oh my goodness, we were playing with ray tracing on. That is, that is such good performance. I want a sniper. Why, why can't I get a sniper? Hello? The price in this laptop depends on the region, but if you use the links, it's uh, $30.99. Recon, sniper. Oh, you, your, your character is locked now to this? What the hell? Okay. So this is silent mode. Look at look at the wattage. What four games are you going to test? Uh, I actually played uh, GTA 5. Battlefield 2042. Forza Horizon 5. <laughs> Wait, I actually hit them with the smoke.
And we still have Fortnite to do, but I'm actually enjoying this, so we're going to play this for a little while. This with FPS Fortnite should be great. It should be, yeah. I've chosen quite random games, just not the usual games I play. I've already played a few games on, on it. By the way, Terra, if you are here or re-watching, I just noticed you became a member again. Thank you, Terra. Stop being a douchebag, dude. Because we're playing in silent mode and we're still getting these frames. Now we're going to put it on performance mode again. This is performance mode. I think performance mode is and silent mode are the best modes. I don't think turbo mode is worth it. Because the fans just kick in and you gain very, very minimal amount of FPS from it. This is a bad spot. Why people buy a Mac instead of this beautiful machine and get no gaming? I mean, Mac, I, I'm not particularly a fan of, 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 of Apple, but I think MacBooks are pretty good, like school machines or work machines, ba excellent battery life, good screens, great build quality, just you can't game on it. So I would never choose it, but I can see why people Choose it. Are you saying that it's good enough to use the performance mode to enjoy a gun game? Yeah, even silent mode works perfectly fine. I'm, I'm, personally, I'm very interested in how uh, how the 4090s will perform in a chassis like this. You would think that would cause a lot of trouble with the heat. So let's play some Fortnite last game before I go and eat something. But this laptop does it all. You can use Office and video. Yes, of course. Of course, yes. Forty nine has different. Yeah, it's also the Scar version. I think it also has vapor chamber. An extra fan, if I'm not mistaken. And I think it's a little bulkier. No, generally these gaming laptops don't have the best battery. Some full AMD systems actually have a really good battery, but when you have an Intel CPU, generally the battery life is not that great. Would you recommend the new Dell G15? I don't know. I have not tried it. I, I cannot recommend anything I haven't tested just yet. So you have to look for different reviews, man. I, I, can, I can tell you from my experience with last year's Dell G15 that it definitely wasn't the best uh, laptop. Though that was the same thing for Asus and they have kind of redeemed themselves. Who the hell is that? Is that that Deadpool? Weird. 
Okay, let's take a look at the settings. Okay, I think we're gonna have to reboot. Yeah, we'll restart now. Uh, I don't particularly like, I like the way Razer laptops look, but if you look at the price to what you're getting, like looking at the performance, that's, no, that's, <laughs> I, I would not, I would not spend any money on a Razer Blade laptop, honestly. Amazon files, yeah, I think they just use a general picture. I've, I've mentioned that in the review and also in uh, the unboxing that this model does not have, that's only the SCAR model. So it, the SCAR model has a little icon here, but this is the Strix model and the Strix model does not have the numpad. And why they're, they're using that picture, I don't know, but it's not on here. So, TSR, I think that is like a super resolution. It's like the DLSS. Somehow they've named these things, these things differently. Uh, where is... Lumen, where is Lumen? There we go. So we're going to use ray tracing here in Fortnite. It's an epic and it's DLSS quality or they call it TSR. I think it's pretty much the same thing. It's upscaling tech. By the way, guys, if you want to see the unboxing of this laptop, there's a video on my channel. This is Fortnite. Once again, I am not a fan of this game, but it is a really, really good benchmarking game as it has Unreal Engine 5. And that shit is crazy heavy. And you might be like want to slap this and like, oh, the performance is so bad. But this is like, the ray tracing in this game is ridiculous. If we would turn this off, frames would look a lot better. Actually, we're seeing higher wattage here. Let's put that on turbo mode. Oh. Okay. We're going up a little bit. Maybe we can reach higher wattage here. I don't know, let's see. No one plays Fortnite on ray tracing. No, I know, <laughs> I, I know, you're right. <laughs> yeah, let's play with lag because that's fun. <laughs> no, you're so right. This is not the mini LED version. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, that is true, Raul. <laughs> this makes a 4090s, desktop 4090s cry on 4K. I have a 4090 desktop as well, and this game just makes that sweat like crazy. I really like your channel. Thank you. I really like your comment. Okay, let's see what happens if we turn the lumen on. 
Because every bloody place with Luminon. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh wait, it's NVIDIA DLSS. Quality. There we go. Oh, oh, okay. This is with ray tracing on. That's actually not bad. This is actually very playable. You just subscribed. Thank you. To all those new to the channel, hello. Hello, let me just do a little face reveal here. Hello. Hi. It's me. Yeah, liking the stream really helps. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Look at this. Wait, is that an Alcapa? Or is that a chicken? That is a chicken. No! <laughs> we just slaughtered the chicken. The chicken. How is battery life in this one? It's okay, it's very average. I have I have not made a video about it, but I can tell you it's very average for a laptop. Okay, where do we need to go? Where are we? We are there, okay. Is that like a boss? What is that? Okay, so we have a gun here. Okay, let's go slay some people. Let's turn that lumen stuff off. Whoops. There we go. So there's no ray tracing. This is just normal performance on ultra settings with the LSS quality. Why no audio? You guys can hear me, right? There is audio. I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> Forgive me. Ooh. What does this button do? Oh. Okay, I totally got destroyed there. Oh, <laughs> I'm ready now. I'm really not good at this game. <laughs> huh. 
how many FPS do this get in a dragon flight or high settings? You mean World of Warcraft? Um, I don't know. Something we can test out. You know, I think I'll stream most likely four more or five more games later this day. Um, I'm gonna get something to eat now. We've played some Fortnite and some more games. What game should I play like tonight? Because I'm gonna play more games. So let's just uninstall these games. I'd like to keep Battlefield. Warzone 2? Okay, there's a lot of Warzone 2 people. Okay, uninstall. Itachi, I just installed that for you, buddy. Mm, we can also uninstall Fortnite. Not particularly a fan of it. I don't really like to do or, uh, synthetic benchmarks. Once again, if you really want to see that, just hook me up on Discord. We can we can do that together. But I won't do it in live streams. I think it's a little bit too dull. Okay, so I saw Cyberpunk. We'll install that. I saw Warzone 2. I don't have Dying Light. So we're going to install Warzone 2. There we go. And how much space do we have left? I think we have 225 gigabytes left. So we have Battlefield 2042. Cyberpunk will get. And what more would you like me to play? Spider-Man Remastered. That's, that would be a good idea as that has the frame generation. Or maybe Hogwarts Legacy. You guys want to see some Hogwarts Legacy that also has frame generation? Would that be something to test? It's also not a really big game, so I can install more. Minecraft. I don't have Minecraft. Or should we do some Reddit Redemption too, maybe? Those games are really big. We'll just install some very heavy games. Spider-Man, all right. I'll see how much space I have left after this one. World War Z, don't spam please. I've just played Fortnite, you can look that back. Well, I think we'll just have to install this and I'll get back to you guys later. I'm going to get something to eat now and drink. I haven't done anything. Stalker, I see Ukrainian flag. Slavo Ukraini, brother. Say strong. Do you have total war? I do not. And that's a ship. Pretty cool, right? It's a Ramadan here. Stay strong, my friend. You are fasting. Yeah. Uh, good luck, man. That's that's heavy. I know how heavy uh, fasting is. I I do. I sometimes do intermittent fasting, so I know what it is like. So, stay strong. Salam alaikum, brother. And maybe I'll catch you guys tonight. Peace. 
and see you soon. Goodbye.